In this episode, we'll explore Calcutta's heart-stopping junk foods laden with sugar, fat, and oil. A culinary adventure that walks the fine line between delight and dangerously unhealthy. But first, let's back up. Calcutta's cuisine, characterized by the influences from its multicultural population, as well as its wide range of iconic sweets and seafood dishes, form the perfect foundation for crafting the most irresistible high-calorie temptations. From this culinary visionary who combines Red Bull and chicken kebabs into a surprising burst of flavor. People might find it very bizarre, but trust me, once you come down over here, you'll be blown away. To this deep fried creation with enough oil to kill a French fry's dream of ever becoming a potato again. <laughs> Prepare your insulin because we're about to embark on the most over the top junk food tour of Calcutta. off with an Indian gourmet experiment. A whole grilled chicken stuffed with tikka kebabs, grilled eggs, and melted cheese. Brace yourself for layers of pure opulence. Oh, baby, don't cry. Actually, Afghani chicken, you can have this at plenty of places, but ours is special because of the ingredients which use. Plus, we add a mix of spices that makes the taste little different from any other places. And the whole concept, the feeling, the stuffing, that makes it a complete dish. Tandoori chicken, everyone knows. Afghani chicken, everyone knows. But the combined mix of the tandoor flavor of the tikka kebabs and the Afghani flavor with a lot of cheese makes it a balanced dish in terms of flavor in terms of taste, in terms of everything. We begin by scoring the entire chicken, ensuring for maximum flavor penetration. Then season it with salt and ginger garlic paste, followed by hung curd, a type of thick strained yogurt. Top that with a secret marinade made from cashew and melon seeds. Then finally, a few drops of fresh cream, a dairy product made from a mixture of heavy cream and buttermilk. Now, the stuffing. Tikka kebabs made from diced chicken breast, seasoned with tikka masala and boiled eggs, marinated in coriander, mint, and a green chili blend. When the chicken is ready, coat it with even more fresh cream. Now for the build. Stuff the chicken with the tikka kebabs and sprinkle it with more tikka seasoning. Then a drizzle of pepper sauce followed by the eggs, cheese and a final touch of fresh cream. Wrap it up and grill until it all melts together. And if you have any doubts, just give it another round of torture. The cheese burst of Afghani chicken delivers a mouth-watering blend of creamy Afghani spices, decadent cheese, and succulent tikka kebabs. It's a perfect option for a last meal on death row, because there's arguably no better way to go than with a chicken-induced demise. fried bread generously stuffed with sweet balls made of cheese. A creation so rich, it might give your arteries a run for their money. My house is open for 3-4 months. This is 50. This is the cigarette sauce. 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 This is the unique thing. We don't have to get the cigarette sauce. We have the opening. We have the set. We have the launch. We have the challenge. We have the challenge. Gula are an Indian sweet delicacy made from soft, spongy cheese balls soaked in sugary syrup. Yes, this is typically eaten as a dessert, but here they've turned it into a most scrumptious filling. Start with the rasgulla. Add it to a heavenly creamy sauce made from milk, sugar, salt, and chili oil. While it heats up, prepare the bread. Roll out refined flour dough and throw it on a hot griddle to create a luscious paratha. Now for the plants, stir-fried capsicum and onions. Fill the bread with the veggies and top them with the rasgulla balls and creamy sauce. A final drizzle of mayo, some grated cheese and chopped masala. The 
Rascula Roll surprises with its savory transformation. Crispy Parata enveloping creamy cheese balls, delivering a harmonious blend of textures and tangy wholesome flavors. Next up, a sweet twist on an Indian classic street food that will leave your mouth bursting with the sweet flavors of rich ice cream and crispy Oreos. Honey Puri is a savory snack popular throughout India. It consists of crispy breaded spheres filled with potatoes, onions, and loads of spices and chutneys. But one day, someone wondered, what would this dish look like if children were in charge? Then, they actually made it. Start with finely chopped Oreos, which will serve as the main body of this dish. Then create a hole on the top of each bowl that will serve as the door for all this goodness. The Oreo goes in first, followed by chocolate syrup, vanilla ice cream, and even more chocolate syrup on top. Complete with a shower of rainbow and chocolate chips. Hey. Each bite bursts with delightful ice cream, crunchy Oreos, and decadent chocolate, creating a roller coaster of flavors in your mouth. Before our next destination, ensure your pacemakers are working properly, because this spot infuses chicken with Red Bull, a daring culinary shock to the senses. We have started this Omai Kebab on uh, 2nd October 2020. So me and my friends went to a particular cafe. So there they were giving an offer of like, if you get two plates of kebab, you'll be getting a can of Red Bull free. So while having that particular dish, I thought of why not make a fusion of both the things and introduce that Red Bull in that particular kebab while marinating and serve it to the people. This Red Bull Kebab has not been introduced anywhere by anyone in this entire West Bengal. People might find it very bizarre, very funny that, oh my God, how can this Red Bull will be added to this kebab and all. But trust me, once you come down over here, have this kebab, you'll be blown away. This is my guarantee to you. Start by chopping chicken breasts cut into bite-sized pieces. For the marinade, mix mustard oil to the curd. Add a paste made from coriander, green chilies, and red chili powder. Then add the spices, pepper, salt, garam masala, kitchen king spice, fenugreek seed powder, coriander powder, cumin, and chicken tandoori masala. Let everything mingle before adding the star of this dish, the Red Bull. Thoroughly coat the chicken before skewering it into kebabs and adding them to the grill. Once cooked, transfer it to a clay pot, top with even more Red Bull and a homemade coriander curd sauce. Tender chicken bursts with smoky, zesty flavors, accompanied by a hint of sweetness and a subtle caffeine kick. A truly unique and electrifying experience. for an extravagant fried fish creation covered in record-breaking layers of batter that will give you an astronomical amount of crunch. ये फिश डिश वेंटर स्टार्ट हुआ था जब पूरा ये लॉकडाउन था तो हम लोग का फर्स्ट घर में हम अपना अपने से बनाने शुरू किए थे यूज्ड टू सेल दिस प्रोडक्ट टू द कस्टमर द फीडबैक वाज वेरी गुड सो आई केप्ट दिस नेम एज फिश डिश एंड वी स्टार्टेड द जर्नी हम लोग का ये कलकत्ता का सबसे लार्जेस्ट बोल सकते हैं आप नॉर्मल रेस्टोरेंट्स क्या करते हैं फिश डायमंड फिश डाल के एग से रैप करके देते हैं हम लोग उसको डायमंड फिश के साथ और एक तो एक्स्ट्रा बेडिंग करते हैं फिश का तो हम लोग रूई फिश बोलते हैं उसको उसका ऊपर फिश डायमंड फ्राई के ऊपर रूई फिश का बेडिंग करके देन वी रैप इट इन द एग एंड इट्स बिकम अ ह्यूज प्रोडक्ट यू कैन सी व्हेन यू हैव क्लिक द फोटोज Biraji is a Bengali street food with deep fried fish coated in crispy egg batter, famous for its crunchy texture. It starts with diamond fish fillets coated in coriander leaves, red chili powder, and a secret marinade made from coriander leaves, ginger garlic paste, and mustard oil. Coat everything and let the flavors penetrate the meat. Then double coat it in panko breadcrumbs and deep fry. Give it another dip in an egg wash and fry once more. This time, drizzle the eggs around it, creating crispy strains of eggs. <laughs> Top it 
top it with more chopped coriander and fried roku fish. Finish by wrapping the egg strains around the fish, creating a deliciously crispy shell. The golden crispy shell encapsulates the tender, succulent fish within. It's a seductive dance of textures, a true masterpiece of deep-fried temptation. And now, our exhilarating exploration of deadly junk food comes to an end. Among these five extraordinary courses, which daring delight left the most lasting impression on your palate? Was it the layers of satisfaction in the cheese burst Afghani chicken, or the creative use of a sweet dessert in the rasgulla roll? Perhaps children's dreams do come true in the Oreo ice cream pani puri. Maybe the marriage of chicken and an energy drink in the Red Bull chicken kebab. And don't forget the insane crisp factor in fish kabaraji. <laughs> Each dish is a testament to the audacious spirit of Calcutta's cuisines, challenging norms and redefining flavor boundaries. For more thrilling culinary escapades that will keep your taste buds on the edge of excitement, stay tuned and subscribe to Best Ever Food India. Introducing Best Ever Coffee. I've traveled all over the world, and no country has created a better coffee experience than Vietnam. That's why I partnered up with the local coffee experts at Le Coff to bring Vietnam's satisfying coffee experience right to your kitchen. Order now using the link below to receive this bold blend of Robusta and Arabica, a fin filter to brew the coffee, and a tube of sweetened condensed milk to add the perfect hit of sweetness. This isn't just coffee, this is an experience.